So while inductive and deductive reasoning are the two different ways that we conduct research that are generally best recognized by scientists, I like to think of this inductive type of reasoning as what I call a spiraling approach where there's a constant check and balance in the research process which allows me to refine potentially my hypothesis or research questions which allows me to let the information in that particular research project unfold the way it wants to unfold. So it's a little less obvious, it's more vague to use this type of inductive reasoning. But oftentimes, if you go into a research project with no preconceived notions, then you can be surprised about what you'll find, what kind of reality opens up.